Okay, pretty proud of this. Uh, I made this, uh, my second knife I've made. And uh, oak handles, brass pins. Uh, it's out of a uh, piece of file and it's really sharp. So I wanted to show you the sharpness first before I did much with it. it makes curls just excellent. And you know if you are good making curls you can use most any knife. But you can tell when a knife really does a good job. This one is really makes them nice and thin. But um, I test the knife out by doing a paper cut test. And one of the other tests I do is using a piece of paracord. And what I like is if a knife cuts it without pushing really hard at it. This one is just really easy. And so it's plenty sharp right now. And so I'm going to do a bow drill fire and do some steps uh, through that as well is to uh, test it out for what it can do and of course batoning you know that's the big deal and people shy away from that so figured I'd do it and uh, no bad results anywhere and it still cuts really well One of the other things I did is I didn't make the point super sharp and since I'm a bow driller I like to do this to get your uh, bow drill started and I'm kind of doing this haphazard here get a piece of paper for my drop but um, anyway let me see if it's focused on the right place here I'll get it closer but I thought I'd do a bow drill and uh, get a piece of wood going with it and I'm just using yucca nothing fancy but you see I made a divot there test of a knife and of course again I'm using yucca so it's pretty soft but I just got this knife made I went over to Drake Takes and we uh, finished it over there putting a the handle on I wasn't experienced at that and so thanks to Drake Take uh, got that done Oh, this just cuts so nice. Of course, like I say, it's yucca, so it should. But I love it. It's just a great knife. It looks pretty. Uh, not professionally pretty, but really useful looking pretty. Let's just see if we can get a coal here. got some cottonwood bark here. Well that's a pretty lousy coal. I'll try it anyway.
So we got the fire. Stop on it with no wet boots. And where's the knife at? So anyway, I made a, uh, a little neck knife previous to this. And it's this one here. Out of a file as well. And I use it for a utility type work, of course, but I really wanted to make a bushcraft knife for myself. And uh, of course, I really didn't do a whole lot of testing, but I'm showing you that it, it will do the job. And I always look at the edge of the knife to see if there's any damage at all. And so all I see is uh, wood curls, very sharp still. No pick up as far as uh, feeling any edges or not, nothing like that. It's a flat ground, 3 16 inch file, flat ground to convex grind. See how well it cuts uh, the paper still. Very nice. Anyway, does that. And of course the paracord slides right through. I love it. So I love my knife. First knife I've made full size. This was my neck knife and so I got a pair of them now. I'll probably stop right here because I'm satisfied. I know the process now. It's a lot of work and I really appreciate uh, the knife makers that uh, I know and uh, have gotten knives from, but love this knife. Thank you.